And those dry conditions are making for some dangerous wildfire conditions up north. Two fires are burning up there right now, one even getting dangerously close to people's homes. It had the propensity to uh, um, affect a lot of homes. Um, very, very scary situation. In Eccles Township, just outside of Bemidji, a wildfire starting Tuesday afternoon led to voluntary evacuations. The Beltrami County Sheriff's Office saying the cause is considered suspicious. Fireworks were being used. There were no open fires. Um, could it have been uh, somebody, uh, you know, throwing a cigarette, lit cigarette out the window of their car? Using airplanes, helicopters, and water from Lake Bemidji, crews were able to get the fire under control, but are closely watching hot spots. There's a lot of fuel out there with the fact that everything being so dry. According to numbers from the Minnesota DNR, the average number of wildfires they see in a year is around 1,400. This year, they've already seen more than 1,600, the highest number since 2015, with months left to go in the fire season. The spring fire season just rolled right into summer. Uh, we really haven't had a stop due to the drought that's in place in Minnesota. DNR Wildlife Operations Supervisor Bill Gleesner says so far more than 35,000 acres have burned, equivalent to the area of the entire city of St. Paul. Um, we have the potential that uh, a start in the wrong spot could uh, grow rapidly. We've been really attacking them fairly hard and fairly quick. Wildfires are also burning in the western United States and Canada. And with so much smoke in the atmosphere, the Minnesota Department of Health has expanded an air quality alert through Friday for northern Minnesota. Now, the DNR says the biggest thing that people can do to prevent these wildfires from happening is to be aware of the conditions if you're having a campfire or setting off fireworks. Now, they update those burn restriction maps every day on their website, and those conditions are constantly changing. So they say be sure to check their website before doing anything that could be a forest fire risk. Kelsey?